Hey, Bill. How's it going? Hey, Jeff. How you doing? Good to hear from you. You know, I'm doing great, actually, and I'm getting ready to write the Amazon Rocket blog. That's cool. I can't wait to see it. So we're launching this quantum computing service, and its development environment is all about helping our customers get started and build their quantum computing algorithms. Do I have that part right? That's correct. So they use the bracket simulators to test, and then they actually run their code on real quantum computers. Absolutely. There certainly seems to be a lot of hype around quantum computers. Tell us what's real. I think the long-term hype is justified. Let me talk a little bit about how quantum computers work. So what you're doing is you're building quantum circuits using qubits and entanglement on, in this case, several different machines. You're taking a particle, setting it up in a qubit. Uh, uh, you're communicating to it with you know, vibrations, waves, heat, with a laser. Uh, vibrations. Uh, you have to remove. Uh, and just like on a regular computer where you've got air correction, to that, there's a noise that comes in and flip this. The number of qubits you're going to have, so how they interact with each other, and then you set them up uh, with entanglement, right? Oh, man, I wish I had a PhD so I actually understood what Bill was talking about. How am I going to explain this to customers? There's machines based on ion trends. All right, I know who to call. You know, we have this four-dimensional space, and the four-dimensional space is X, Y, Z, latitude, longitude, and time, right? We have to meet each other in time as well. And so it operates. Hi, Jeff. What's your quantum computing emergency? I was talking to Bill, and I desperately need the real-world perspective on quantum computing. Can you help me out? Sure. Customers are exploring quantum computing because they think it's a promising technology. Okay, so it sounds like our customers are testing ideas, opening the door to see what's possible. Yeah, lots of activity around quantum computers. Great hardware development, but also people looking for applications. And Amazon Bracket would be a great way for customers to access multiple quantum computers to test and build algorithms on the cloud. I think I got it. You can set up multiple shots and multiple circuits, and you can set up multiple qubits. Uh, so it provides a lot of flexibility, and we also enable this sort of con. All right, Bill, I think I've got it. I know what it's going to take to write the blog about Amazon Bracket. That's great, Jeff. You know, I'm always happy to help. I guess I could have just said it's like a launch pad for people to go explore quantum computing.